Hi guys, I'm gonna show you today how to assemble Brimless drawers from Ikea. Let's do the job now. We start with the side panels. We're gonna have two side panels. Each panel have a two legs, two plastic legs. Just tap them in, there is no screws, anything like that. We're gonna have four rails on each of the side panels. Four left, four right. Just check out there is a mark on each rail, left or right. Secure each rail with the two screws, one at the front, one at the back. Make sure the screws are touched properly, the heads are not sticking out. Otherwise, you're gonna have a problem with the drawer. It's gonna, gonna stuck there. Two locks on each of the side panel. Just place them in for now. Two screws on each side panel at the bottom. And we can prepare the dividing panel. We're gonna have two thicker ones and one slimmer dividing panel. Two wooden plugs on each dividing panel and two plastic locks on each dividing panel. This one is the slimmer one. I have only two wooden plugs on each side. So we place the thicker ones at the bottom, secure the locks, just twist it, and on the top there is no lock, just holding with the two, with the two wooden plugs. You can place the other side panel and secure the frame. Watch out here, the frame is very wobbly at this point. Turn it on the front side and prepare the top panel. There's two screws on each side and two L-shaped brackets at the back, just in case you want to attach the drawer on the wall, two wooden plugs on the top of each of the panel, each of the side panel, and we can place the top panel, find the right holes, tap it all in, and secure the locks. We're gonna have two locks on each of the side panels at the top. You can put the back of the drawer measure the, co uh, the frame if it's in the right position 90 degrees each corner and we can secure the drawer the nails all around it. that's it the frame is done you can put it on the side for now on the middle we're gonna have uh, two screws secure them in not completely in this rail gonna hold the middle basically it's just securing the middle part there is no any solid panel to hold the middle part so that's why it the rail is there okay we're gonna have uh, side panels for the drawers we're gonna have four left four right the two wooden plugs on a, on one side and two plastic lock on a, each of the side panels for the drawer we can prepare it all in then we can start to join the drawers two screws at the front panel each front panel we're gonna have a two screws on a, each side so four screws for each front panel we're gonna have three full drawers and one uh, with a frosted glass that one's gonna come on the top on the middle at the bottom there is small screws I'm gonna tell you later on for it is so we can place the side panels the locks are from outer side watch out where is the holes for the rail it should be at the bottom Secure the locks on the both sides. I just do this one, it's exactly the same on the other side. Don't forget to lock it. This is the bottom of the drawer. We're gonna have four of those, just place them in. And the back of the drawer, four, just place it in. Secure it with the two plastic plugs on each side. Secure it all in with a hammer. And we can put the rails. Don't forget to position the side with the wheel at the back of the drawer. Secure it with the two screws, one on top, one on the bottom. Exactly the same on the other side. We're gonna have two plastic plugs on each side. So the back of the drawer secured, and we can and we can place the rails on the other side. Exactly the same. Two screws holding each rail, and the wheel is at the back of the drawer. This is the support for the drawer, it's just a rail which is hooked on the small uh, screw which we did before on the middle, you remember. So hook it at the bottom and secure it on the top. Drawer handle, two screws through the front panel, secure the drawer handle. This is just, this rail is just to secure uh, the drawer on the middle so you can load it heavier without the problem, it's a good thing. Exactly the same on the last one, this is the one with the frosted glass, secure it with the screw on the top. 
two screws through the front panel holding the drawer handle. Secure the screws, it's all done, this is the one with the frosted glass. The last thing we can put the stickers on the side, Jackie provides the, when you close the drawer it's not going to be the loud and that's it. And this is it, Supremeness. Just a trailer from IKEA. Hope you enjoyed the video guys. If yes, thumbs up, subscribe to my channel as always, don't forget. And see you in my next one very very soon. Have a great day.